Now, today's Through the Decades Retro Spectacle. In the 1920s, with the mass production of Ford's Model T, America was mobilized like never before. On the move, on the road, and looking for places to eat. This new car culture gave rise to a unique twist on the traditional restaurant, the drive-in. The first drive-in opened in 1921, a place called Kirby's Pig Stand in Dallas, Texas. Customers would pull up, order, and eat right from the comfort of their own cars. It was a simple concept that by the 1950s would become all the rage. As the highway system in America expanded and road trips grew increasingly popular, drive-ins flourished, offering speed, convenience, and a cheap meal. They were a go-to for travelers on the move, with service that would have customers dining and on their way in no time. A hallmark of that service was the so-called car hop. Waiters running around the parking lot, shuttling trays of burgers, fries, and milkshakes from one car to the next. One of the charms that kept people coming back for more. But drive-ins weren't exclusive to road trippers, nor people in any particular rush. In towns and cities all over the country, they attracted teens and joyriders looking for a place to spend an evening. They were central meeting grounds, somewhere to gather with friends or enjoy a first date. But the heyday of the drive-in began to wane in the 1970s as fast food restaurants like McDonald's adopted the drive through In some corners of the country, there are still drive-ins, keeping alive the nostalgia of the era. The American romanticism of a summer night out on the road or on the town, enjoying the simple pleasures of a quick and easy meal.